Hello guys, welcome back. Look at what we are having for the evening. Meanwhile, look at this. We have stamps on our meat. Like when you buy meat from the butcher, some parts of the meat is like stamped. This is from the authority because um, some people sell meat illegally and some of those meats are like contaminated and all that. So this is just a way of ensuring that we are eating something safe welcome back let me know where you're watching this from guys my name is Eunice yeah this is actually pretty today we're having goat stew for the evening so let's cook this together Some garlic and some ginger. I'm going to add in it. I'm going to wash it and put it on fire to start steaming. Oops, there's this rosemary, I'll add it later. to steam until the water drains off. some little cooking oil. Just a little bit like that. And leave it to heat up. Then I'll add in the onions. Then I'm going to add it. 
why the birds are making noise they're giving them medicine right there in that house you know their house inside their sorry it's dark you'll not be able to see but they're treating them okay back here now we're adding carrots and some green pepper just decided to pound it there's always feel like the aroma comes out more when it's pounded I'm going to add in it here. and whoo the aroma is already <laughs> so I'm just going to add in water for it to cook now And there we are. So I pour the water until it covers it. It will have to get ready until the soup, like like the water drains to a good size. Yeah, so let's leave it now to boil. Well, I choose to add the, this is black pepper. I choose to add black pepper when I've already added the water because I don't want it to burn. Like there's a way uh, under the saucepan burns when it's so dry, and then you add again powders in it. So I'm going to add this and some turmeric as well. Then I leave it to boil. And there we are. And yes, guys, our sauce is actually ready. I think you notice how the soup has reduced just the size I want. So I'm going to serve this with smashed cassava. I once shared with you how to make smashed cassava, so I won't share it again today. Guys, check out for that video if you missed. It makes a very yummy food with this soup here. Oh my goodness, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Uh, I should tell you good night because it's almost time to, for bed here. After eating, we're just going to bed. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. In case you're new here, ensure that you subscribe. Yeah. Bye-bye.